Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here, and in this video, we're going to do a quick speed test comparison of uh, the IQ Z3 with the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max. So these two devices are around the 20k uh, price segment. Now we have, we know that IQ Z3 comes with a uh, Snapdragon 768G octa-core processor, which is one of the really powerful 5G chipsets. While we have the Snapdragon 732G octa-core processor on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max. So this is a 4G device, but there are advantages and disadvantages for both the devices. So let's just uh, have a look at the specs. So we, we here we have 2.8 gigahertz. Uh, uh, 768G while here we have uh, uh, the Snapdragon 732G uh, and uh, here both the devices have Android 11 and uh, here we have Funtouch OS 11.1 .1, while uh, this is MIUI 12.0.1 now this device the one which we have right now hasn't got the MIUI 12.5 update so MIUI 12.5 obviously improves the performance so uh, let's uh, see the uh, here we have a uh, six gigabyte RAM on this device uh, while we have an eight gigabyte RAM variant on this device. So that will also have a slight impact on the testing. So we'll just uh, quickly have a, a test. So here you can just clear off all the background apps. So there you go. So we have cleared off all the background apps. Now let's uh, see the network connections. So both are in airplane mode and both are connected to the same Wi-Fi network as well. So let's start the uh, speed test. So there you go. So before going into the test, let's clear off uh, the background apps once again. So there you go. We have cleared off all the background apps. So let's start the testing with uh, Asphalt 9. So both have the game turbo mode enabled. So let's see uh, which is able to load uh, the game faster. So we already know that Snapdragon 768G is uh, much faster than the Snapdragon 732G. But how fast in terms of app opening, that's what we are going to talk about or see in this uh, quick speed test. So you can see that IQ uh, takes the lead, but uh, the uh, Redmi Note 10 Pro Max is in far behind. Uh, just a couple of seconds additionally took. Now Temple Run. So once again, you can see uh, IQ is faster here. Next, uh, Play Store. Uh, here, probably uh, IQ did have an advantage, but not by a huge margin. Browser. Again, IQ is faster. Facebook. Again, you can see IQ is faster. Twitter. Again, IQ did a win here. Instagram uh, again IQ is faster Ghana uh, probably almost same time not much of a difference Amazon again IQ did have a minor advantage Flipkart again uh, you can see IQ did have an advantage file manager IQ was faster here. Settings. IQ is faster. Again, IQ was slightly faster. Gmail. Uh, Redmi is faster here. Camera. Again, IQ is faster. And again, IQ is faster. So that is a comparison. So you could see that IQ did have an advantage in almost all of the apps except one or two. Uh, but uh, you have to consider that uh, Redmi Note 10 Pro Max was still not far behind. It is just a fraction of a second uh, faster. But uh, IQ does have a lead here because of the Snapdragon 768G chip. Now next is the memory management. So let's uh, open in the reverse order. So there you go. So, so far all the apps are written but here you can see that uh, YouTube has been reloaded on the IQ I mean Redmi Note 10 Pro Max settings available file manager Flipkart is reloaded Amazon again it is uh, reloaded here Ghana again it is uh, reloaded on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max Instagram is reloaded. Twitter is uh, reloaded. Facebook is available on both the devices. Chrome is uh, once again reloaded. Play Store is available on both the devices. 
Temple Run is uh, reloaded on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max. So finally, let's uh, check uh, Asphalt 9. So Asphalt 9, while this is a full reload on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max, this is uh, uh, not the entire reload. Uh, it uh, does happen uh, quite some time, but you can say that both have reloaded it. So in terms of memory management, you can clearly say that uh, iQOO Z3 is the uh, winner here because it was able to uh, keep uh, most of the apps in the memory while uh, Redmi Note 10 Pro Max uh, was uh, reloading almost all of the apps except for a few ones. So we expect things to change with uh, the uh, MIUI 12.5 update which is coming up uh, out soon on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max that should improve things because that is uh, a, a drastic improvement in terms of performance so we expect that to happen pretty soon. So that is a quick speed test comparison of the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max with uh, the iQOO Z3 uh, with uh, the Snapdragon 768G competing with uh, the Snapdragon 732G on the Redmi Note 10 Pro Max. So that's it for this video. This is Normal signing off. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.